So you know those cabinet curtains, like uh, like any if I've traveled in Europe, sometimes the kitchens have little curtains instead of cabinet doors. However, okay, I was looking at this corner, which has like my mop, like any plastic bags that make it to my life. I collect them there so I can take them back to where they can recycle them, like in a bulk thing. And just like other cleaning supplies back there, but it always like looks very messy, cause it is. I'm gonna get a tension rod to go between this space and hang a cute little curtain down it. So I've already been on Etsy. I think I found two that I like. I think I'm gonna stick with the blue theme. This print, like very cute, or this is just like fabric I can make into it. Yeah, but I thought that was a good idea and so simple. So I already ordered a curtain rod and then I can have it covered up and it'll be like a little European kitchen in here. Also for my day, I'm about to go run some errands. I need to go pick up medication that is ready. And then I need to, all my packages this week I happen to like have a few things that I had ordered and usually they're fine to my address, but for some reason UPS decided that they don't want to leave them here anymore. So now they're all at this collection point that I have to go find and figure out how it works. Gonna go do that, come back, and then I might film another video depending on if Sabrina can come over to help me or not. And then tonight, probably gonna go out, do something fun, we'll see. I truly love when like and I feel like I just always expect things to be just like hard here but I love when I go to do something and then it turns out being like super easy everyone's really nice to you and like you get in and out really quickly <laughs> and that just happened to me and it's a nice little reminder where I'm like oh it's not always it's not always so hard. Should I open these for you? <laughs> okay, I'm very excited for these. I feel like I'll wear these tonight. They are right. Oh, I've wanted a pair of spliced denim for so long. I hope these are what I want. And then I saw these on Object Limited. I'll link the seller because they do like all spliced denim. And I was originally gonna just get two shades of blue, but I actually loved the gray and black. Like these are just so fun. Um, this is like a treat because they're kind of expensive, but I just think they're so cool. Um, and just like, it's nice to have like a little refresh on denim. I guess I might put these into a haul, so I don't know if I should show. I got a pair of hokas because I've had my other ones for about a year. I've worn them a lot. I will still continue wearing them, but I noticed that my feet are hurting, the bottoms are wearing down. So these I think I might dedicate now to working out, and then my other ones will be more of like just walking shoes. Let me show you. I picked this color because they're always out of stock in colors, but I thought this color was cool. Ooh, a little rainbow. Oh, they're so light. Yo, hokas are one of the things in the world where I'm like, these are, worth it and they are also just feel like clouds on your feet. I feel like I said that when I finally got my first pair, um, but they're very nice. So. And 
And the biggest thank you to Buy Humankind, which is the sponsor of today's video. I'm so excited. They just came out with their hair care line in their aluminum bottles, which is amazing to opt for aluminum over plastic, which is one of the most widely recyclable materials. So each set eliminates 3.93 ounces of single use plastic waste from your shower routine. And when it's empty, you can recycle the bottle and then you can transfer the reusable pump caps to the next refill so you can get more of a life out of them. They use all natural ingredients. They're vegan, gluten-free, and sulfate-free. And truly, all their scents smell so good and so natural and so fresh, like eucalyptus, tea tree oil, lavender, so, so good. And I definitely prefer my shampoo conditioner coming in a liquid form, so it's nice to have it in the aluminum, which is just widely more recycled than plastic. By Humankind has a lot of different options for lowering your waist, so like dental care, toothpaste, mouthwash, floss, deodorant, so many different options so definitely check out their site for more and check out their new hair care options and for the rest of my hair care routine I always just use some type of leave-in this is hair milk by John Master Organics so nice it's really creamy it's new to my routine but I like it a lot and it's just super hydrating so I've just been putting that in and scrubbing up my hair and then I'm good to go muscle so I after I work out I make my little protein smoothie this is my fave one just blueberries some type of nut milk and protein powder so easy so good the ritual protein powder is really good it's vanilla so it makes it taste literally like cake sometimes I'll do half and half of like half vanilla half unflavored so it's not like 
too sweet, but so good. Trying to get ripped. I'm also losing my voice after last weekend. popsicles lately just because it's hot and they're so yummy I love popsicles I feel like in my adult life I hadn't ever bought them unless I was specifically sick and having them when I'm not sick is so good also I sound sick right now but I'm not I just apparently use my voice too much this weekend I just finished The Pursuit of Love. It's like a mini series. There's only three episodes. Uh, it just rocked my world. I love love and I, uh, this show just really, just really got to me. Shot beautifully, like feel inspired by it also. Wow, I'm sad, but it was so good. I can't believe I haven't talked to you more today because my voice is raspy, and that's the best time to chat. If anyone else has watched The Pursuit of Love, let me know. Let's talk about it in the comments below, because it was good. And tomorrow, I'm waking up early to go to Bath House, which is a spa in Williamsburg, um, that they're doing like an influencer event, and I get to go swim in their pools. They have like different saunas and pools and that makes me so happy I've been like needing water to swim in but yeah last week I had a rough week this week has already felt better starting off better realizing the week before I get my period I literally have been having the most intense mood swings that I've ever experienced like correlated to period timing probably in my entire life so that's been hectic and like I kind of thought that's what was going on but now that I like got my period and turned a corner I'm like oh I like felt so intense last week and uh, it's so wild that it's just like yep yeah, we'll just deal with it I also was gonna start this painting tonight I have that big canvas but I'm so nervous to start it and so I feel like I've just been looking at it for months on end right now which is very exciting I love bathhouses and also spas <laughs> but you know when I can get up this early for something is when you know my love is real <laughs> Like, comment, subscribe if you want to smash that sub button, you can. Make sure to check out By Humankind. Such a cool company. Love them. Love them, love them, love them, love them, love them, love them, love them. Link in the description to do that if you want to. And I'll see you so soon in the next one.